What's going on, comrades? Drewski here, back again for another Thirsty. toasty review. Thirsty Thursday edition. We have McKellar's Nuclear Hop Assault. It's going to be quick, straight to the point. Um, it's a Imperial India Pale Ale, 8% by volume, alcohol by volume. Um, McKellar is a, is a brewer that is based in Copenhagen, Denmark, and imported into the U.S., obviously. But they are a pseudo brewery, meaning that they don't have their own site. They don't have their own dedicated brewery. They uh, give the recipes to other brewers to make for them. So that's pretty cool. Didn't know about that until I researched this beer. But let's get into it. I generally hate IPAs. Um, I only like standard, like pale beers. But. This is going to be nice and chalky for me. I can already tell by the sniff. It's got that hardcore fucking pale smell to it. Uh, it smells like liquid street chalk. That's my, that's how, I, oh god, look at that fail pour too. That's, that's just a pour that, that just signifies I don't give a shit. So uh, let's, let's taste this foam. Ah, it's some good foam. I literally only drank the foam. <laughs> Game's done installing by the beeping noise. Um, it's really strong, really pale, but for an eight percenter, that is really modest. It's it's got the typical flavor and body of a pale beer. Bitter, um, slightly sweet. Um, but yeah, it's. Not, I mean, I want to hate and shit on it, but it's just because I don't, you know, I don't prefer the beers. But honestly, I, it's not bad, and I'm slightly enjoying it. Um, and I, this was six ninety nine, five ninety nine, excuse me. So this is a six dollar twelve ounce of beer. So it's not cheap. Um, the taste is all right. Um, give it one more official Drewski taste test and then I'll give you the toasty review All right, nuclear hop assault let's assault my liver with alcohol oh god no I might be regretting that soon Woo! <laughs> excuse me but, uh, nuclear hop assault on a Drewski Thirsty Thursday Toasty Review rating. That's a solid t -t -t toasty. It's a good three out of five toasties in my book. Um, the reason why I rate it higher than the uh, Baltica that I had last week is because for the taste and the percentage of alcohol... It's really good, like, I don't know what I'm trying to do here. But it's a, it's a really good balance. Um, the price point is what I don't recommend. This is There's no reason this couldn't be a $2 beer. But I don't know how much it costs to import a 12-ounce beer from Denmark to the U.S. So I'm not going to start that discussion. So would I recommend it for a try? If you don't mind spending $6 on a 12-ounce beer and you like IPAs, more power to you. Give it a shot. Um, I probably won't buy it again, but it's been been fun trying it, and that's from someone who generally hates IPAs. So, nuclear hop assault, three out of five toasties, definitely definitely good one to give a shot. So glad I tried it. Till next time, we're gonna have another toasty review coming up every Thursday at least for Thirsty Thursdays. As always, it's been Drewski for Yellow Buckets signing out again. Peace. Toasty!